A New Jersey judge has ruled that women who are undergoing labor can ban an unwed father from the delivery room. Now, this is a case involving Rebecca De Lucia and also Stephen Plotnick. They are no longer together. However, Stephen Plotnick wanted to be notified as soon as she went into labor, and he also wanted to be in the delivery room as she gave birth to their child. However, she did not do so, and as a result, he decided to go through with a lawsuit. Now, the judge decided, hey, you know what, the well-being uh, of the woman in this case, while she is in labor is more important because she is the person who brought this baby to term and she's the person who ultimately gets to make that decision. Let me read you his words exactly. He says any interest a father has before the child's birth is subordinate to the mother's interest. Even when there is no doubt that the father has shown deep and proper concern and interest in the growth and development of the fetus, the mother is the one who must carry it to term. He also says any mother is under immense physical and psychological pain during labor. Uh, the order the father seeks would invade her sphere of privacy and force the mother to provide details of her medical condition to a person she does not desire to share that information with. I, I think the judge is absolutely right. I mean, I, I like Stephen Plotnick a lot. I mean, he wants to get involved in the uh, kid's birth and his life and et cetera, and so bless his heart for being a good father about that and even taking it to court. So I don't mind that he tried to do that. Mm -hmm. uh, but. Of course you can't have somebody in the delivery room if the mother objects. I mean, it's going to stress her out. It's not going to help the situation. Yeah. Uh, you know, you, at that point, you have to put aside all the differences. And we don't know anything about the personal relationship between the two, but even if the mom was wrong about everything else, she still gets to have that sphere. Now, of course, I think you should be allowed to see the baby immediately thereafter, right? Yeah. As soon as they, they bring the baby to the maternity room or whatever you call it where, where they keep the babies. I've only had two babies, what would I know? Anyway, <laughs> that's where the dad should be allowed to see the baby as soon as possible, but he can't be in the delivery room. Yeah, so I half agree with the judge. So, oh. so I do agree that while a woman is in labor, you got to give her what she wants because you don't want to put her under more stress while she's delivering the baby. I mean, she is under a lot of mental and physical stress in that moment. However, I don't think that there's anything wrong with him being notified that she's gone into labor, right? I mean, oh, it's, his, yeah, that's true. it's his baby, so um, I think that she should definitely notify him, or she doesn't have to call him directly. She can have a family member or someone from the hospital call him and let him know, hey, she's giving birth, she doesn't want you in the delivery room, but as soon as the baby's born, yes, you have the ability to see the baby, it is your right. Now, I think that he does make a compelling argument about how, hey, you know what, father's rights are important as well, because, you know, when push comes to shove, she's gonna ask for child support. So why is it that he is financially obligated to take care of the child, but when it comes to those very precious moments, he's not included. But again, you have to put your differences inside when it comes to delivering the baby. Now, let me do what is never done in the real world. Uh, I now amend my opinion uh, to concur with Justice Kasparian. Okay, <laughs> right. uh, I agree wholeheartedly. Justice Kasparian nailed it on this one. And uh, yes, of course, he, they should let him know that the kid is being born. Yeah. <laughs> okay. And he should be able to see it as soon as possible. And uh, I mean, I hadn't even considered about the about the money, right? Mm -hmm. If he's on the hook to pay for the kid, and then you're not going to let him see him. Oh no, hell that's unacceptable. No. Okay.